Hey guys, welcome to a live reaction to One Piece chapter 996. I got Kevin right here. Hey guys. Hey Marco, how's it going? Oh, it's going pretty fine because there's no break again. No nice. break next week. Oh yes. How are you doing? Yeah, pretty good. Excited for this chapter, to be honest. Oh yes, because I had a really rough week because my PS5 came uh on time oh but it's broken oh shit yeah, yeah that sucks i got a i got a 500 bucks brick at home <laughs> love it and yeah i got a new one in 20 days <laughs> i had a shit week <laughs> yeah i bet yeah but whatever we got this chapter now that's the only thing I'm looking forward to today. <laughs> After this, all this stuff with the PS5, I'm really worked up about that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can get that. Getting a new product and it's it's not working is always kind of the worst. Yeah, but whatever. Let's start with this one. So, guys, we got the cover page right here. It's chapter 996, Island of the Strongest. I like that title. And we got Blackbeard and a hippo brushing their teeth. Request by AB. All right. <laughs> <laughs> weird, weird one. Yeah. But better than the beige, uh, better than the beige story. <laughs> Everything's better than the, the beige story. If Oda yeah. would, would draw... A, like like a pile of poop with eyes. <laughs> it's already instantly better than the base story. <laughs> and more people would care. <laughs> oh god. Oh god, yeah. Okay, uh And I have got my chopper right here. Yep. Small and big one. <laughs> okay. So you start. Okay, sounds good. Okay, first story, uh, first, first story, first page. Okay, um, Animal Kingdom, bath, forehead floor inside the dome. Um, where did that thing come from? That was a Komainu, line dog from the Wano mainland? Okay, Otama Komachio. Thank you. <laughs> woof woof. So, oh, Tama, Tama saved, uh, successfully saved Nami. And Usopp. Uh, Usopp, yeah. are you alright? Pei Pei, go bite that stupid dog in two. Why me? You do it. What? <laughs> <laughs> There's some sibling fighting going on. Uh, blah, blah, blah. What's with... What's with Usopp? No, no, of course you're not yeah, alright. <laughs> yeah, but... Uh. But let's He's focus. Not in good shape right now. But let's focus on the positive. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> okay. Hey, Otama, how did you get here? We got a ride on the enemy's ship. What with the enemy? Um. She came. Was she on? But well, we have seen her before on Higashima. So either she's here for a long time now, or she's coming with an enemy's ship, and it could be anything. It could be an outside force. Mm, yeah, that makes sense. I mean, it, well, it could have yeah. been an, uh, anybody, but to be honest, the highest chance she has to get on a ship uh, and not be like not have a hard time would be Kaido, right? She would just give dangos to all the beast pirates and then yeah, smoothly yeah. sail over. Even That's with true. the even with the lion dog. <laughs> yeah, with the lion dog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but she could still uh be like she's on Kaido's side and this is Kaido's dog or something like that. So she could easily sneak on an enemy ship, I think. She's a kid. Yeah. But 
the dog is a little bit too big. But what if she she came like with like Marines and they were talking shit about Luffy and the Alliance, so she immediately guesses it's an enemy an enemy ship. I don't think the Marines are there. I don't think either, but it's just a wild guess. <laughs> yeah, no, I get it. But I think the <laughs> best chances for her are get a ride with Kaido's forces. Yeah. Yeah, probably. Okay, Kia. Keep them at bay for three minutes, Hihimaru. Ah, uh, what's with this baboon? Wherever in the world did you come from? So the baboon is here too. Okay. But they're yeah. ferocious. The giant monkey's in trouble. Don't belittle his power, no, Nami. We came here as samurai. <laughs> okay, Otama, but that monkey's done. <laughs> yeah, I think so, too. <laughs> All okay. right. Right brain tower. Is it really called brain tower? Okay, never mind. Uh, center well, hall. the official release, so... <laughs> yeah, be. it's just a little weird. And we got Yamato side boob. Everybody cheer! <laughs> it's just, uh, yeah. Of course, it's the first thing you saw. <laughs> what what did you expect from me? <laughs> I see side boob. I have to announce it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's see Ta uh, Yamato, and she's breaking shields, and she's fighting. Get out of the way. You'll never finish all of us, young master. They still refer to her as a young master. And they're shooting at her with bazookas, but... Whoa, she takes the damage like a champ. Mm. Oh, next page, yours. <laughs> Look at the bottom right, when she, when she tanks all that stuff. One just could have easily shoot that Momonosuke, the yeah. left one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> but all right. Okay, she kind of gets damaged here, right? Cough. Yamato, you can't keep doing this, or... You there, if you're a samurai, make up your mind. Abandon me and save Lord Momonosuke. No, Kozuki Odin would never do that. Why are you stubborn? If you think you can protect that weight and still defeat me, I take that as an insult, Master Yamato. Okay, big right. words from Yamato, but I mean... And big words from Sasuke. She's right. He's, he's confident that he's stronger than Yamato. Yeah, I don't think so. I think he's just uh, seeing that he has the leverage on his side, so he's playing his cards. Hmm. Um, and he knows that he has a, a slight advantage, but not because he's stronger. <laughs> okay, let's see. I can go losing my superb armored division. You've really made a mess of things here. And he's taking out his sword. Whoa, that one looks weird. Maybe like a, a whip? Oh, like... yeah, but what is Yamato? Okay, just go on. Sasaki... Uh... Ha cha cha. Is he a fish is man? Is, is Yamato transforming? Or, or transforming, yeah. Yamato's transforming, right? <laughs> Yikes, looks, look out, and there's uh, Frankie Shogun coming. Or, or no, wait. Or <laughs> Yeah. What? Fran Franosuke. <laughs> with, with who is? What? With the number. You know, the, 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 this Hacha guy is following oh. him because he thinks he's, he's, he's a toy. Because we, you got your Hacha Cha, Hacha Cha. Yeah, you're <laughs> right. I, I just realized that now. <laughs> he's bringing the number along, okay. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that you, Momo? Oh, I know who, the, who that is. Luffy's companion, Frankie the Cyborg, 94 million berries. Yeah, she, she, she knows it because she's in Kylo's mansion, right? Yeah, they they probably have all the wanted posters in there. But yeah, Queen has them. We saw them. But she knows even the very number. I mean, maybe she's yeah because a... she was waiting for Luffy. 
She knows all of them. She was waiting for this crew. Yeah. I've never seen anyone like him in my life. <laughs> and there's Hacha. Hacha, Hacha. <laughs> Stop. Just because you can't catch me doesn't mean you should. Hacha? What is that idiot doing? <laughs> Hacha! <laughs> <laughs> She's smashing the floor. Yeah, that works. <laughs> and oh, 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 oh! Wait a moment. Frank is here. Yeah. Have you seen or have I posted these fan theories of Frankie versus Sasaki? No. This is a pretty big theory in the community for a few chapters now. Because when the um, the color of the new volume released, we saw we see all the Toby Ropo, and Sasaki's hair is green, and he's a fishman, and we know from Water Seven this Kokoro mermaid, who managed the train. Remember her, mm -hmm. the green-haired woman. Oh shoot! She, she she has a son, and we haven't seen the son. Yeah, he could and be the son. There is a theory around that Sasaki is the son, and because Frankie was running out in the running outside, and Sasaki is outside, that this will be the match up in in one of Frankie, and it will they will come. They will talk about Water Seven and stuff like that. Oh, that makes total sense. So now. We are on track with this theory. <laughs> nice. But the the weird thing is, will he be in flashbacks with Iceberg? Like, was he still around then? As, or... a, kid, as a kid, maybe. Yeah, because you never, seen, uh, see, uh, you never see him, basically, in the flashbacks. Yeah. That's a weird thing. Or, may, or maybe he's the father of this little girl. She also had green hair, right? No, she was blonde. She was blonde? Either blonde or light green, but okay. it's still a possibility. Okay. But I'm leaning to Kokoro. Yeah. Same here. If I would have to bet. Okay. Yeah. All right. Next page. And he busted a hole in the floor. <laughs> what the hell's happening? Uh, Frankie in the air. Um. Ah, oh, right down was an option. <laughs> Yamato being like, oh, we could have just escaped. <laughs> well, in those kids, Shinobu will escape through the floor. Mobo, Shinobu, are you okay? Are you caught? No, we're being rescued. Who's that? Frankie the cyborg, take care of this. Okay, Luffy put me in charge of these two. Frankie versus Sasaki, okay. Yeah, it looks like that. Yamato is escaping with Shinobu and Momo. In that case, okay. sure thing. Uh, oh, sorry, your page. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, so um... I think uh, before we get to Act Four, we got we got all the matchups yeah. without fighting. And in They're... Act Four, we get all the fights, like in Dress Rosa. At the climax, fight after fight after fight after after fight. Yeah, that I think makes this sense. Will be Act Four. Okay. In that case, sure, thi sure thing, whoever you are. I super got this. <laughs> I ought to thank him. Huh? Just a moment. At least I can take out that one. And she's swinging her club. Okay. With a shock, with a shock wave. Oh my god. That is... Narikabura arrow. That is Sorrow style right there. <laughs> <laughs> Like, oh, I, I can't reach him. There's, ha there's Haki. Um, there, there's Haki flying around from this club when she swings it. Oh, yeah. At the middle panel. Yeah, I you see You can see it. the Haki. Oh, no. Oh, you can, you can see it <laughs> at the top down, left. Right? <laughs> yeah, you see it at the top left, too. Look at her hand. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. So definitely a hockey shot. That's wild. Yeah, that should be it for Hacha. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh yeah. It is. Next next page. Yeah, he's done for. He's killing over. <laughs> huh? Did that mystery person do that? Who was that? 
Oh no! Hacha! <laughs> thump. Well, that's not just a simple thump. That's half an earthquake. <laughs> hey, Yamato! Just, uh, hey, Yamato just took Momonosuke down that hole. Quit wasting time! Down the hole and after them! Huff, huff, Momonosuke. You must survive. It is imperative that you survive. You're, you are the one who must guide the world to the dawn. Yeah. Is, um, is, how? Does, does, does she know about the ancient weapons, maybe? Don't, the, don't tell me Momo is Joy Boy. No, that would be... no. Maybe he guides the world to the dawn as part of these drawheads? Like, like maybe to even though he could be Shogun, but I, th I, I think Hiori could also take over Wano, and Momo and Tama join the Straw Hats as like Kevin boys, Kevin girl, because they need to get some, right? Yeah, but no, no, it it won't happen. Out of two reasons. But how? But how is he guiding the world to the dawn? Either he's a straw head or or he's Uranus, right? Yeah, I think she she suspects him of being being a, an ancient weapon. She knows more. She knows more because of the journal. Yeah, she does know, probably from Odin himself, that uh, Momo is is an ancient weapon. It's yeah. the only thing that makes sense. It's probably, it's probably that Odin learned in on Love Tale that similar to the Fishman, like Shirohoshi, that a certain son is born in the Wano country every hundred years mm. with this power. Yeah, that sounds and, about and, right. And he guessed that with Momo because he saw something in, in, in him. I don't know. Maybe there was an incident where they were attacked and Odin couldn't, or or the pirates couldn't, couldn't react quick enough, and Momo just told the Sea King or or Land Animal or whatever to screw off. Who knows? Maybe he saw something um, already when they were on so with the fourth pony glyph. Yeah. And Momo did something with Sunisha. Or maybe that. Yeah, that's also a pretty good. Uh, Guess. But I don't know. Yeah. All right, second basement floor. So we're also in the basement. And okay, we haven't seen that guy for a long time. The people of the D are known as the enemies of the gods. What is law? Oh, okay. I like that part of the story now. <laughs> There's a pornoglyph. <laughs> My true name is Trafalgar D. Waterlaw. Their alias? That's right. That's not the road Pornoglyph, but Law has his own side mission now. And I like that side mission because the side mission is actually a main mission in One Piece. Yeah. I think he's looking for the Pornoglyphs while there's chaos. Maybe even steal them because, I mean, he got the power. He can just port it. Can he? I think so. Why wouldn't uh, he be able I'll, to? I'll I think the material of Pornoglyphs, this indestructible stuff, is similar to Sea Stone, and he can do that with his power, I think. He can pull it up, because we saw that already, but I don't think he can do something to it with Devil Fruits. Mm, I don't know. Like, we, we, may, we might see. <laughs> he, can't, he can't read them anyway. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay, next page. Um... I'm stunned, have you? Uh, you have the, the name of D as well. Robin, okay. Okay, flashback to Robin. You're the only one I would tell this. Thank you for your trust, but I don't have the answers for you. Luffy may not care, but I find the D name to be fascinating. So the only way is to follow the red stones. Yes, and that means beating the four emperors. Not that they'll make it easy. Not this one. Need a rat stone. So it's a normal pornoglyph he found. Yeah. Hey, hey. New one. Yeah. Hey, Cora, I've made up my mind. I want to know the meaning of this checkered fate. Okay. okay. So this scene tells me Law has no um, 
he, he doesn't betray the straw hats by doing this here he only wants to know the meaning of this of the d that's his mission yeah and he trusts the straw hats that's what he also tells us here he would never betray the straw hats he just goes on his own side mission here and wants to know something about the d yeah <clears throat> next page but, uh, okay all <laughs> right <sorry>. um <laughs> <laughs> i thought i thought you you were still oh okay okay you know, waiting for me to continue <laughs> uh third floor yeah something's coming this way we see metal flying around we know what that means yeah <laughs> ah it took my weapon i'm being swallowed i'm being swallowed Maybe he got metal parts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's you, it's Captain Kid. Do you think we've got enough killer? He's dragging along all this crab metal in the castle. <laughs> Stop him. Don't let him reach the roof. Oh, that is... Is he, like, He's... collecting uh, on the way up to the roof, collecting every metal he can get <laughs> yeah. to fight Kaido? Yeah, I think he's he's collecting supplies for uh, a big fight. <laughs> just wait for his double page with his bow. <laughs> with gigantic metal arms, we see we see this the Onigashima skull and on top of it this huge metal hands. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, that page. that will be intense. Also, mm -hmm. nice side effect. He's taking away weapons from minions, so what yeah. are they gonna fight with? <laughs> Okay, good question. And there's Killer! Our enemy is the world's strongest pirate. You can't have too much. Haha, <laughs> good answer. Onigashima. Raw. <laughs> Roof of the Skull Dome. Oh, this panel of Kaido. <laughs> and we see angry Kaido face. <laughs> oh, this, this panel is amazing. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> bush. Him on his down. Okay, that is fast. And he's slamming down again and slamming another one. Oh, Denjiro did it. Him. Yeah. Yeah, okay. But another one. And Denjiro is down too now. So, oh my god. Okay. Raizo is down. Denjiro is down. Karamatsu is still fighting. We see in the background, I think, is it? Inurashi or no it's probably Nekamamushi right yeah I think so too uh, uh, <clears throat> yeah they're all getting defeated at the moment okay that was to be expected yeah okay but they did better than I actually expected at the beginning I, f I yeah. didn't think they would hold out that long <clears throat> That's true, yeah. so performance floor skull dome and we see Big Mom rushing in on, on Prometheus. Ah, Big Mom's back. <laughs> and we see uh, uh, Robin kind of worried. Oh god, uh, ha uh, Chopper halfway frozen looking there. Uh, Big Chopper. Mom. <laughs> then there's Sorrow, X, X Drake, and, and Apu. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm only interested in going up top, where Kaido is. And of course, they don't want that. Oh, I love that. I love that uh, Big Mom is going up. Two at the same place is not good. Two emperors at the same Luffy, place. Kid, Big Mom, Kaido, they're all meeting at the top. This will be amazing. Yeah. Oh, I, I, I'm just waiting for this. Oh my god. Uh, that's what I love. The, this chapter, one of this is one of these chapters I love the most in One Piece. We get like six or seven scenes completely uh, completely different placer, places. The whole place is in chaos. We and got the Yamato stuff, we got Law, we got Big Mom, we got Kit, Tama with Usopp and Nami, there's Kaido with the scabbards. We got all this stuff in one chapter. It's it's only one page each or two pages each. But I love this chaos. Even if we don't get that 
much progress in each story. Well, there is. But I love this simu simultaneous stuff. Yeah. Okay. Mm. I guess that's okay, the last page. Of... Oh, yes, that's the last page. Middle of the second floor. Hurry, hurry. What floor are we on now? If we climb those stairs, we'll be at the third. The roof is above the fifth floor. Got it. Just the way, Kinemon. Huh? Hey, do you guys hear that? Can't you hear it from the third floor? Hear what? And Nami's observation hockey. Come, my dear. That's it. Nehehe. <laughs> With a heart, okay. But my lord, you mustn't. It will be so naughty. <laughs> Sanji's observation. <laughs> what the hell? <clears throat> That's the end of the chapter, okay. Uh, yeah. Next chapter is November 29th, okay. In eight days, so we get the, yeah, so we're on track with, so the unofficial one is on Friday again, okay. Okay, yeah. So Sanji's observation hockey is, is fine-tuned to hearing naughty stuff. There we go. <laughs> uh, my lord, you must, and it would be so naughty. So who's the Lord? And who I don't think it's Black Maria. No. Be because because she's not the one doing something to a girl and she is not the Lord. <laughs> and no one would mess with Black Maria except mm. Cairo. <laughs> well, is it one or King? Or King is the pervert. We know King is a pervert. Maybe he's doing something to the Cortesans. Wait. Since when do we know King is a pervert? Queen called him a pervert when they, when they were introduced. Oh, okay. Maybe. <laughs> my lord. But I don't, I don't think... Are they calling Queen a lord? lord Queen? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. I, I think I... in the prison they called him Lord Queen, right? Yeah, I think all of the flying six are, are called Lord. Calamities, right? Oh, Calamities, yeah, sorry. Yeah, okay. I Okay, this chapter is a 10 out of 10 for me. Definitely, a lot of stuff happening. <laughs> Definitely a 10 out of 10. It's a small cliffhanger. A small cliffhanger. I would have liked it more... If this next chapter hits November 29th, would be at Big Mom's page. And that's the end. Yeah. But I still... Because that I... would be like, okay, Big Mom is on up to the roof at next week. Yeah, okay, she won't be in, on the roof next week, I think, but... Yeah, but we still don't know her motive. Is she yeah. trying to assist and take out Kaido, or is she going to... Um... I still think Kaido. she will betray Kaido, and Big Mom is the bigger threat than Kaido in his arc. Yeah. Well, it depends. He, she, she still needs to collect, you know, homies, if she wants to take on Kaido. In this country, there are right now three road poneglyphs. Wait. Three? So no, no way. There's the has so... got destroyer has got two copies. And oh. there's one on there's another red one on Onigashima. Yeah, right. Big Mom knows the Stroids were messing with the road pony glyphs, so But she doesn't know she they have them. Could... Yeah. Maybe she knows there's one on So. So if she knows that, she could know there are three road pony glyphs in this, on this island right now. And that's a kind of shortcut to the one piece. So if this fight is over, when the fight is almost over and everyone is on the verge of defeat, Big Mom is going to back backstep Kaido, I think. I mean, it, it would make sense, but I still think she doesn't know that uh, the Straw Hats have copies. Because she she got broke and she, you know, he, he hid the stuff and she didn't find it. So she didn't yeah, okay, even suspect it. true, yeah. I, I yeah. don't think she would she would ever like know or, or think of uh of the straw hats having them. Same with what would have yeah. happened with Roger when he was at her place and basically stole the road road pornoglyph. Yeah. <laughs> It'll happen again. 
Or That's basically, it's ha it happened again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, good chapter. Definitely good chapter. Um, I don't oh, know yes. what will happen with... I don't think Yamato and, and Momonosuke will join Luffy. It'll be like with um, Shirahashi. He will stay in the country because they need an emperor. And it has to be Kozuki. Yeah. So, so either no him way. or Hiori, but probably him. But maybe they'll need him to do something. I think he'll release Sunisha after. Yeah, after I'm still Kusura. waiting for Sunisha in this arc. Yeah. Actually. Yeah, maybe. I, I, I think maybe not in this arc, but I think. Probably in the in the Love Tale flashback, we will get a Sunisha flashback. Why? What's the sanctions he got? Why? Yeah. Why does he have to walk around for eternity? And I think this is related to this skull of Onigashima. This was also an ancient creature, and which has had to do something with Sunisha. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. I mean, you can go crazy with theories there. Yeah, I've seen an incredible theory on, on the Sunisha, why he has to walk around for eternity. This is incredible. And it connects to Wano and how Wano is split into all these islands. The Winter Island and the Main Island and the Prison Island. And... You may, Sunisha has this country on its back mm -hmm. and the theory is that Sunisha failed to bring this country as another section to Wano and Wano when the world government took over the world uh, Wano was a place for countries in the world to the allied countries in the world like Fishman Island and so and also Wano itself, um, all those countries would be gathered like, above the waterfall to be saved from the world government. Mm. And Sunita failed to do its job to bring so to Wano. So he had to wa so Joy Boy ordered him to work for to walk for eternity, um, so that no one would find so with the road poneglyph on it. Yeah, that makes sense. Basically, making it a, a phantom island that's yeah. un undetectable. That's that's pretty good. That's a good theory. So, it, so it's not really a sanction for Sunisha, but kind of like a job. He has to protect so at any cost mm -hmm. because he didn't bring it to one country. Yeah, not only that, but think of the road pornoglyph. Yeah, I think that's. And that's... We, al we also we also got Fishman Island. Maybe Joy Boy, because we know he failed to bring the fishman to the top with the Noah. Maybe he also wanted to bring them to Wano. So it should, it could also, it, Wano could be a, a safe place for all the allied people from the ancient kingdom, from Love Tale. Yeah, that could be. And that's how Wano was connected to the world, but just should have been a safe place. Hmm. And the or... guy, the people who managed to bring to bring Wano together, all those islands. One of this was the ancient Ors, because Ors is called the continent puller, the one Moria got. Yeah, definitely would so, make sense. Plus, so maybe the, the oldest, so maybe the oldest Ors, the leader of the Ors people, is the skull, and he brought Wano together. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah. That's uh, kind of, uh, that's one of these huge theories I, I found on Reddit, <laughs> but I love it. That's a good theory. Yeah. Yeah. But that's a weird cliffhanger, to be honest. I, I guess yeah. say this chapter's cliffhanger is so weird. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's really King, Lord King. And now Sanji really gets to fight King. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> being pissed off that King's getting some action, I guess. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> that could be, yeah. Oh, so what's Jinbei doing? Jinbei is, is it, maybe is really joining the Luffy on the top. Could be. Because there's no, one, there's no one left, right? Well, um, since Sa Sasaki, or Queen. what's his name? Yeah. Sasuke, Sasuke is finding Frankie. That's... Yeah, definitely. Else That's I would have good. said Fishman versus Fishman is always a good option. But yeah. now that that's <clears throat> happening, he's... But Frankie has the past probably with Sasaki. Yeah. Frankie hasn't seen Sasaki. Maybe he knows him from the past. Mm -hmm. That yeah. would be great. What, yeah. wait, Frankie would be like, what are you doing here? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and maybe maybe also this way Sasaki will be an ally. Could also happen. That would be really weird. But you of know it would be weird, but they need to get more allies in this arc. They will if they stop the spread of the virus, all the the, the Kaido minions will switch sides if they cure him. I think that's what's because, gonna happen. Because I, I I think um al another allies we will get in this arc, not only Drake, but also Hawkins and Apu. Yeah, definitely. Well Apu, I, I don't Apu, know about Apu, Apu, but I I think Hawkins Apu will join. Is angry about Queen. <laughs> yeah. This I think Apu will will join the alliance. He's like Get off of me! Get this! Get this antidote! <laughs> <laughs> and Queen wants to kill him, so Apu will be like, "I'm joining those guys. Try to kill me." <laughs> yeah, maybe he's he is a coward. He will switch sides, like Italy in World War Two, if necessary. Yeah. So, <laughs> and the thing with Hawkins, oh, Hawkins, God. we know he has this card, which exceeds one's limit. He, he told us he, that he has a card that um, he can, like, uh, give someone 150% power, something like that. <laughs> power boost. Yeah, he can give someone a power boost with a card. And that needs to happen in this arc, because he mentioned it in Wano at the beginning. Yeah. But who will receive it? Luffy. Luffy. Who else? <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course, Luffy. Yeah. Wow, okay. Good arc. I'm, I so, really liked, liked it. For I now, mean, I will... good chapter. But also, the arc is amazing. Never a dull moment. Oh, yes. <laughs> this whole Onigashima stuff. Yeah, it's, it's full on war now. I love that. Yeah. So I'm right now on the Reddit top comments. Um, wait, are these the okay? Um, what are the top comments? Where is one? The first one was shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there are no funny ones. Oh! One has a theory that because Yamato was about to transform and she got these teeth, um, may maybe she is a, she's the mythical tiger. Hmm. From okay. the, um, so because in Japanese culture or in Chinese culture, there's the mythical dragon and the mythical tiger. So maybe, so maybe Yamato is the tiger. Yeah, could be, but I don't know. Like, hmm. that's a far-fetched one. 
Yeah, maybe. Or maybe she's also a dragon like Kaido. And that confirms that Kaido has an only only fruit and is actually a dragon. Yeah, that's that's a good <laughs> theory though. But also far fetched. <laughs> I mean you can't yeah. say anything at at this moment. But just imagine. <laughs> that would be wild. That would be truly wild. I mean, it's got to be a Soan. We know that. Like, he's regenerating at a rate that's just insane. Yeah. <laughs> it's not that he doesn't take damage. He just... He tanks it, and then he regenerates immediately. Mm-hmm. Because we saw him, like, <laughs> lying down a few times in this arc. He just gets up. Like, pfft. Please. <laughs> mm. I think this is more regeneration, to be honest. So, yeah. Be, uh... The only fruit? I don't know. It's like it's a possibility. Yeah. But anyway, I, I think we have to call it a video. <laughs> uh, mm hmm. Yeah, good chapter. Uh, 10 out of 10 from you. Oh, I, yeah. I give it a 9 out of 10 just because that cliffhanger is just so yeah. rando. It's, okay. It that breaks it. A nine to two. Yeah. Just breaks it. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, everything else is awesome. So. And the yeah. only three chapters left. I hope there's a, bi an, a huge cliffhanger at 999. Oh, there will be. I hope the act is ending at 999. Because that would confirm chapter 1000 to be a huge lore fest. <laughs> yeah. That would be awesome. Especially since Oda always loves to throw Because his character lore. down. Yeah. I am expect Luffy is now on the third floor. I'm. We got three chapters left. I'm really expecting Luffy to go to... Um, to go to the rooftop and at 9.99 and this carrots are actually all that. I don't know about the that part because Oda doesn't kill that many uh, characters yeah, in the series. This would be, this would be a, such a huge cliffhanger for 9.99. Maybe, maybe all of them except Kinemon. And when Luffy gets there... Kinemon is getting killed. <laughs> I don't know. I'd like it. I mean, nothing against it. But, uh, I mean, as far as I know Oda, and he's only killed how many characters? Two, basically. Whitebeard and, and Ace. Two, Two big, yeah. big characters. Yeah. I mean, he he even brought back the Hawk guy in Alabasta. What's his name? Uh Pal. Pal, yeah. But this was this was because of 9-11. Yeah, I know, but He uh... brought back Pound and <laughs> Yeah, he brought back Pound. He brought back Hachi. Hachi? Uh the octopus guy. He was never implied to be killed. He wasn't? Uh, Hachi d d never had a bad moment. <laughs> I thought he had. Yeah, never mind. Sorry. But, but Bon Clay is alive. Bon Clay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> super important. Bon Clay is alive. <laughs> I mean, he's a funny character, and he he helped Luffy a lot. He he is important to the story at key moments. Yeah. <laughs> yeah but all right guys please like the video please comment please subscribe <laughs> and i guess we'll see you next week on chapter 997 maybe on friday probably on saturday but all right see you next time yeah. Kevin, see you next time. See you next time, Marco. We'll hear from us anyway. Yep. But 
on you, YouTube see the next time. <laughs> yeah. If you want it or not, we'll be there. <laughs> okay. So okay. guys, Nakama, goodbye. Yeah, bye guys. Thanks for watching.